The other common custody arrangement is shared parenting or joint custody. This says that both mom and dad are legal and residential custodians of the child. The only place that there's a difference is that one parent will be residential parent for school placement purposes. Now, there's a common misconception that the parent who is residential for school placement purposes somehow has the upper hand, that they are the uh, stronger <laughs> custodian in the shared custody arrangement. But I'd like to clear that up. It's really an issue related to the schools. It's really a question of what school is going to pay to educate that child or what address the child will go to school from. Specifically, say you have a special needs child and dad is residential parent for school placement purposes. If he lives in the Reynoldsburg School District, then the child will be allowed to go to Reynoldsburg schools. Say the child has some kind of special needs and those needs can be addressed in a different suburban school system. The Reynoldsburg schools would still be responsible for paying that other school system to educate that child. That's honestly what that provision is about. It's about what the school system is responsible to educate the child. But that's really an aside. <laughs>